In this video I'm gonna show you how to fix the unsupported CPU error or the CPU does not have SSSE3. So make sure that you watch this video till the end if you want to know how to fix it. Before we start I just want to say subscribe to my channel and like this video if it helps and let's start. So the first step is to open the origin launcher. Go to my game library, right click on Apex Legends and click on update game. This will download and install any new update on your PC. And once you're done, the second step is to open the origin launcher again. Go to my game library, right click on Apex Legends, go to game properties. Make sure that the enable origin in game for Apex Legends is unchecked. So you don't want this to be checked. And now go to advanced launch options. And write slash use all available cores in the command line arguments. Once you write this, just click on save. And the third step is to open origin once again. Go to my game library again. Right click on Apex Legends. And now click on repair. This will download any missing files on your PC for Apex Legends that may be corrupted or may be deleted, etc. So just click on repair and this will verify the game files and re-download all of them. Once you're done, you can close the origin launcher. And the fourth step and, and the last step or the fourth step is to right click on Apex Legends on your desktop. Click on properties. Go to the compatibility tab and make sure that the run this program as an administrator is checked. Once you check it, click on apply and click on ok. And now do the same thing for the origin launcher. So right click on the origin launcher on your desktop, go to the properties, go to the compatibility tab and check the run this program as an administrator box. Once you check it, click on apply and click on ok. Once you're done, you can now restart your PC and open Apex Legends. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel and like this video if it helped. Bye.